Hello friends. Um, I, this is going to be a video for how to do a pony step. So, um, you either have this in your dance already in the chorus, or you're going to have it in one of your verses or both. Um, so I thought I would break it down since it's actually a pretty complicated step. It seems like it should be easy, but getting the coordination can be a little bit hard. So, um, I'm going to show you how to do it. We're going to break it down real slow and I'm going to show you how to switch your feet uh, when you're in a pony step, okay? So I'm going to actually put you on the floor so that you can see just my feet. You won't be able to see my face. You may see my cat or my dog. Um, I'll introduce them right now since they're right here. So this is Artemis. Artemis is my cat. She's very big. And then Reggie, my dog right there. He's a very sleepy puppy, but sometimes when I start dancing, they like to get involved too. So you might see them. Um, so to do a pony step, I'm gonna put you down and I'm gonna stand up, okay? So to do a pony step, what you do is you put one foot up like this. So if you have someone in your house that wears a high heel shoe, what I would recommend is asking if you can borrow it Borrow one shoe. Well, you're, you'll actually need two to practice on both sides. So put one shoe on, but don't put on the other one. And see how it feels to have one foot up and one foot not. Because what you're gonna do is you're gonna keep this foot up like you're in a high heel shoe. And then if you put your weight up like this, it's called a pony. It looks kind of like a pony is galloping. Because they kind of do this like lopey thing, okay? So you're just gonna keep the one foot up. So if you're ponying on your right foot, so this is my right foot, you're gonna put your right foot up, okay? So from the back, this is my right foot. So you put your right foot up and you just step and step down. Step on your right, step on your left. Step on your right, step on your left. And then you start going a little faster. And it makes you go up higher because one of your feet is up on their tippy toes and the other one isn't. So it's like you're going from your tippy toes to a flat foot. And so it gives the illusion that you're going high when you're not. And it makes it a more drastic movement. So if you're doing it on your left, which is this foot, it's the same thing. You just put your foot in that high heel shoe and up and down. So from the back, this is my left foot. And you can pony forward. You can pony backward. You can pony in a circle. Yeah? All right. So to switch, what you do is you have one foot going. Oh, there goes a cat. You have one foot going. Okay? I'm going to show you this from the back, too. So you have one foot going, and you're ponying. And when you switch, what you do is you go up and down. So you just step up in a shoe instead of stepping all the way down or yeah. So what you do is for a second, you're up like this and then your other foot comes down. The other one stays up. So from the back, if I'm switching from right to left, I'm doing this. And then for a second, I'm up on both. And then I drop the other one. Yeah. All right, so that is the pony step.